So my aunt hates when I call this the Dieter Lexus <laughs> because it's hers. Um, she asked me if I'd take it to the car wash and I politely obliged that, uh, that I would do that. We are looking, I am looking for a new front bumper. This one is literally just held on with zip ties and screws, you know, it, 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 it got hung. I should make Taco Bell pay for this at a certain location uh, because their curb had the rebar sticking about six inches up above the curb. And that's what it did when I backed the car up, broke it, and then actually pulled it away from the car here on the corner. You can see the gaps. Um, I should have made them uh, replace the bumper because their stupid parking curb should not have rebar like that. Uh, anyway, we're gonna take it for a little ride. I just uploaded a video on this one about a month ago. I think it's got about a thousand more miles. I think it's got almost 166 on it. It's uh it's a dirty, it's a dirty bird. But man, this thing runs so good. Such a good runner. seatbelts on hope everyone had a wonderful Thanksgiving hope everyone got to spend time with family and friends or friends and family combination of the two I do not like rear view mirrors that point down at the ground I want to see where the hell I'm going I don't want to see the road I used rear view mirrors and grew up being able to see the line of the driveway. And if it's pointed down like that, I can't see the line of the driveway. It doesn't help me much. Man, this car is so smooth. To have uh, almost 166,000 on it. It is so smooth. seat for me. It's almost 65 degrees today here in Georgia. Tank average 27.3. She uh, aunt had to drive about 100 miles to get here freeway so that's pretty good. That's pretty good miles per gallon. <laughs> Because uh, my aunt has a little bit of a lead foot. And this car encourages lead foot driving anyway. Because it's so freaking peppy. I had an 06 ES330 that I loved. That was a great car. Got taken out. Uh, Sideswiped at a red light. But uh, it was... A great car and a great car to drive, but the 3.3 was not enough horsepower for that car. Um, I don't know, I can't remember what the 3.3 V6 was rated back then, but um, this 3.5 that they put in this car starting in 2007 with the redesign of the ES, now that, this is a motor, people. This is a motor. 272 horsepower. I think 255 on the torque. This is a hoss. Um, love driving this car. And I missed my turn. I 
hear acorns rolling around up under the windshield wipers. This car just handles so well. You know, you can drive it with two fingers. I would suggest having both hands on the wheel if you floored it though, because it would jerk it out of your hand. Okay, we gotta get some climate control. We gotta turn on some AC. Turn the stinking oh temp. Could not remember how you turn the temp down on this thing. Okay, shaky Nelly. Go to car wash. I love car washes. They're relaxing. Always make me kind of sleepy. Oh, the Lexus Park Assist is having a fit. <laughs> well, at least I know it still works, especially that front bumper up there. Because that poor front bumper has been beat to piss. Oh yeah, it shows you right here up there on the display. At the top there as well. That's nice. Now we'll get to watch the rear go off maybe. just for the front end. Yeah. Got leaves under the wiper, so I'm hoping these blowers will blow some out. Maybe. There's a few going. Oh yeah, there they go. All right, now it's time for a little vacuuming. And hopefully she'll be shined up. Now, she looks a little better after a bath. Wasn't the best car wash I've been through. I had to get, a, I mean, it didn't even get a little bit of mud off there. I had to get the, the wet uh, drying rag and get the brake dust off the wheels. I mean, it barely cleaned them. Boy, that corner's looking kind of rough, isn't it? That's unfortunate. But it's the roughest spot on the car, other than that front bumper up there. But the paint still has a nice shine. Old car cleans up pretty good. All right, car wash done, vacuum on the interior done. That was about the worst car wash I'd ever paid for. I mean, did not put a dent in all the brake dust on the wheels or trying to get some dead bugs off the front of the car, but this thing's a little overdue, I must say, for a good detail. <laughs> But anyway, just a little quick jaunt. An update, I guess, on the ES350. I know it's only been a month. Uh, but we're at 165, 926. I will continue updating this car. Because people seem to like it. 
as time goes on. Anyway, y'all have a great afternoon, and we'll see you next time. Like, subscribe, comment, peace.